Back in my old workshop, I had a place for everything. I had frequently used clamps hanging on the end of one of my pallet racks and spare clamps in a drawer. Now I seem to have piles of them on every surface, appearing like uninvited vampires. I started with an old piece of 3x2. I didn't like the paint job, so I just cut it off. I marked out my waist and took to it excitedly with my brand new router. This is already turning into a dog's breakfast. Not going well the way I'm doing it, so I'll do it another way. I put a flat top blade on my saw and used a pencil to mark out the left and right extremes of the cuts. Seven thousand cuts later, this is what I end up with. I made a real pig's ear of the planing, but that's par for the course for me. After a little bit of adjustment on the saw, I had a nice tight fit. I used a roundover bit to smooth over the edges, and this time my brand new router purred like a kitten. So I'm using 3x2s for this project, and they come from the factory rounded over a little bit. And, um, I've gone and used the router and rounded it over more and I've done it a little bit too much and created this gap here in my notch. I don't like the way it looks so I'm going to get rid of it. Keep the blade here.
Doesn't look too bad, eh? My wife thinks linseed oil smells like garlic, but she's wrong. It smells like dead fish. My small Bessie clamps have a flat clamping face and I'm worried about them sliding off and falling on the floor. So I'm just putting in a little nail to lock it in to make that little slot tighter so they won't slide out. Well guys, that's it for this one. I managed to take care of those vampires and get them up off the floor and off the benches. If you like this video, give it the big thumbs up and maybe subscribe to my channel so I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.